Hello everyone and welcome to another video. This is a diamond painting video and um, yeah, I just got a delivery so let's open it up. Okay, so I have a few things here. Um, they do have my address on them, so I've got to keep them facing down. Um, so I'm just going to move them to the side and we can start opening. So this is a little funnel. I'm going to take it out of the packet and hopefully there's not too much crinkling. So this funnel is for when you've pulled your drills out somewhere and you want to move them back or basically just transferring your drills. Um, it just has this little here and you can pop it out like that. And then it flattens for easy storage. So yeah, that's just going to make cutting up my drills and things a little bit easier or putting them away once I'm done. With the project if I'm getting down then this is just a useful little thing um, and all of these by the way were from Aliexpress so I can link the shops that I bought from down below but um, yeah they're all from Aliexpress let's put that there This is just a collection of little squishy grips for putting on the pens that come with are often quite thin and if you're working with them for a long time it can hurt your hands. So I'm not going to bother opening this up because it's quite uh, self-explanatory. It's pretty much just like a pencil grip that you can slip on. Okay, so these are two paintings, and I just need to check that neither of them are the surprise one. Okay, so I have, these are quite small, um, hopefully they turn out well. Um, basically, it's quite well known that um, the more drills you have, like the bigger your image is, the better the clarity. It's basically like pickle, pixels, um, and so these are quite small. Um, and so hopefully they look good. I'm not sure how they're going to turn out, but um, we'll find out just from doing them. I will open these just now. I'm going to open the other packages and then we can have a look at all the paintings together. Okay. So then this one will not be a surprise. Okay, so let's just wrap them up with these in here. Okay. So that is. Oh, okay. So that is the drills. And these, this is the. Paper. Oh, my goodness. This looks like it's double sided tape. I did not realize I ordered a double sided tape one. Um, I have never done a double sided tape one. So <laughs> hopefully this goes okay. But um, yeah, that's just open I'm, I'm not going to this one let me just show you the image here it's kind of shiny on the light um, I don't know it's basically a little fairy holding a little kitty cat um, and but I don't want to open this up because this is double-sided tape and I <laughs> need to do some research on how you work with a double-sided tape because I know it's very difficult to move the drills and things like that so this will be a later project. We can look at the drills and things that came with it. So this image has 32 colors in it. That's a better picture of 
what it's going to look like when it's done. Again, these are small. I did order really tiny ones, and so they might not be the best. Um, but they will be quick to work up, and then I will know for future <laughs> um, what kind of size I like working with. Uh, but yeah, so basically there are 32 colors. Um, and I don't think that these are DMC colors. I don't really know how you tell unless they actually tell you that they're DMC colors. Which means I don't know how to tell if any of these are Aurora Borealis um, AB drills or not. Um, just looking at them in here, I don't think there are any. This is the little kit that came with, and I see it actually came with tweezers, and that's the first set kit that I've got that has come with tweezers. This also has a little funnel, which is really nice. I don't have any of these trays that have a funnel. So this is actually really useful for me, and along with the tweezers, because I don't have any tweezers. So, let's open up this one. So as you can see, it's a really cute little, uh, oops, oh my gosh, my cats are being crazy. It's a really cute little um, unicorn, and I'm really excited to try it out. There's 19 colors in this, um, and I, again, don't think that these are um, DMC colors, but um, I'm quite excited. Looking at, like, when I ordered it, I was like, oh, 20 by 30 is quite big. But actually looking at it, it's quite small. Also, I this definitely, wait, you can tell. Yeah, so definitely the canvas size of this is 20 by 30. This image is not 20 by 30, which I'm pretty sure it said on the listing. That's not the shop's fault. That's me for not really thinking about it. Um, so this is definitely smaller than I was anticipating. However, it's a good, it's a good learning thing. And this is also part of why I ordered off AliExpress because it's, significantly cheaper and I can basically while I'm exploring this craft and getting used to it um, I can discover what I like and what I don't like and make mistakes <laughs> um, in a more affordable manner but anyway this is really cute I really love the original art let's look okay so this is just your standard kit that you usually get um, here are the drills These are actually in little bags that already have the numbers and stuff, which is great. It means I don't have to do any kitting up. I do have other bags that I could decant into, or I do actually have some of those sort of like pillbox shaped um, containers for keeping these. But there are not a lot of these drills in each one. I'll find it easy enough to just put it in and out of the tray. Um, and it's already got the numbers and everything, which is great because I hate wasting like using plastic and stuff when I don't need to and so they often come in plastic things that you can't reseal so I need to move them so I'm really happy to see I'm really like the fact that these are already in containers at, um, already in bags that I can reseal and they've got numbers so that's perfect this is pretty much kitted up and ready for me to start on when I'm ready Uh, this is not the greatest picture of it, which is a bit of a shame because I do like cutting these out and sticking them into my um, kind of log book. Um, so that's a little bit of a shame, but I mean, it's really not a big deal. Um, yeah, so that is just what the page looks like. And I think that's everything. I am just noticing something I really like is that in the darker areas, the symbols are printed on in a white and then in the lighter areas, it's printed on in a black. And I really like that. It makes it very easy to work with. I have not yet invested in a um, light pad. And so this sort of thing makes it really easy for me to see the symbols and to work on it. And the last one that I ordered, aside from the surprise, is this one. This is a very cute little um, cupcake. Uh, it was like a tea, well, 
mug that has some plants growing out of it and then like it looks like whipped cream or something on top I just thought it was a really cute design and I like the colors um, this one again comes with your standard sort of kit that comes with this one was from the same company as the unicorn so I'm expecting it to be pretty much the same Yes, these are all already in their little baggies, which is great. Um, I'll just have a quick look. I like the colors. They're really nice colors. Nice mixture of bright colors and sort of pastel colors. Just a quick glance over them. Pretty sure there aren't any ABs in here, which I wasn't really expecting there to be. Oops. Do not get those mixed up. <laughs> and then again, the printing on this image here is not great, but I mean, that's not really... That wouldn't stop me buying from a company um, and these are obviously not stickers they're just um, kind of printed out and again this one also has the nice thing where well I see it's a mixture in the background of light and dark but like here it's mostly fives and twos and the fives are light and the twos are dark so that is really nice it makes it quite clear um, for what you're working with um, yeah it looks overall pretty clear and I'm very excited to start working on them. Um, I did, I know, like I said, I'm quite new to Diamond Art. I know licensed art is an issue um, where some cheaper places might be stealing artworks and not giving the artist credit. Um, I did try and look for these. Um, I did do like a Google search and image search to see if I could find the original artist. I really couldn't. The only images they came up on was like, Shin, Timu, and um, AliExpress. So I don't know if this is like AI generated art that they're doing for these. Um, obviously, if anyone knows the artists for these, please let me know so that I can give credit. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm just quite new to this hobby and I don't want to be spending too much on something that I'm just getting into. So I hope you enjoyed unboxing these with me and having a look. And I will see you next time.